Hey everyone, Technometry with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to take screenshots in a few different ways without using your buttons on your iPhone. So let's get started. So normally, if you're taking a screenshot, you would use the volume up and the side button, pressing and holding at the same time and letting it go to take a screenshot. Maybe it isn't working. Maybe you can't time it. There's a few different other ways you can do it. The first way to do it is by going to your settings and you're going to want to go ahead and if you're using Siri, enable Siri. So you're going to select the Siri is on and there are the side button and simply ask Siri to take a screenshot as you'll be able to do it with this command. Hey Siri, take a screenshot. As you can see, I can get Siri to take a screenshot and then I can open it up and then go ahead and share it, save it, do whatever I need to. That's, so that's one way. So I'm going to save it to photos here. Another way is if you don't like using Siri, you can also go ahead into your settings, go to accessibility, touch, and then go down here where it says back tap. Click on either double or triple and then use the back tap to take a screenshot. So what is a back tap? Basically with this setting on, you can tap on the back glass twice to take a screenshot. So if you want to take a screenshot of this page, you simply and then as you can see here, it also takes a screenshot for us and we can do the same exact thing, save it to wherever, share it, mark it up. So I'm going to save it to photos here. Now another method, if you don't like to do that or you simply can't get it right, it's going to be again, we're going to go back into the main settings here. We're going to go to accessibility and from there on, we're going to go to touch here and then we're going to turn on this assistive touch. Now once you turn on, this little circle thing pops up and this will allow you to do certain things as well, like this options that are available. So I click on it and then click on device. And then I look at pretty much more here. And then I can see there's an option for screenshot. As you can see, if I click on that, it will also take a screenshot for us. So there are a couple other ways to take a screenshot if your buttons aren't working for take, take a screenshot. I hope this video is helpful. So please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.